What's up, everyone, and welcome back to another Area Restricted PvP Challenge. I am here with Link as always, and in this episode, we are hitting up the Catacombs of Curend. Now, of course, since we don't want to go in there just punching monsters in the very beginning, we are going to have some very basic starting gear. We're going to have a Dragon Scimitar we feel like is not too overpowered, but can't get the job done fairly quickly in killing monsters. A Slayer Helmet, because a lot of monsters in there do require some Slayer gear. And, of course, the anti-dragon fire shield, so we don't get roasted by dragons in about two seconds. Now, we are allowed to use everything in the castle of Curend, and also every monster is fair game inside the catacombs. And uh, we cannot use banks, so everything we do, we have to do just uh, in one inventory, man. Anything you want to say? Well, we, uh, we bailed out to the comment section and decided to extend it to two hours as well, so I think, you know... Yeah. Pat on the back. <laughs> Pat on the back to us. We listened to you guys. Yeah. We listened. It we took it took hours. a lot of nudging, but <laughs> we're finally giving you guys two hours. So we're gonna yeah. have a crazy amount of items, honestly. There's so many good loots yeah. that we could potentially get here. And mm -hmm. I feel like it's gonna be really exciting. I'm very eager to see your layout at the end of this, man. Yeah, me too. I think we will, I, I think we'll have different setups. I do. I really do. Playlist will be in the top right hand corner of the screen. So click that to get caught up on all the other episodes. One is always on Link's channel when mine goes live. So be sure to check out its episode after this one as well. All right, Link, I'm ready to uh, hit the timer. Okay, man, I'm ready to go. All right, three, two, one, start. Good luck, Link. <laughs> Good luck, dude. May the best man win. And oh, uh, really I will see you in two hours. Right, boys and girls, you are listening to this week's winner because we are going to win this. I have such a good plan. I don't know what's going on with the uh, water down here in the catacombs. But uh, yeah, enjoy the black features, apparently. I got to call this dumbass. Oh, my God. Hey. Hello, Rog. How are you, mate? I'm doing pretty good, man. You sound pretty excited to hear from me. But uh, I, I actually came to roast you, bro. Well, that's nice, isn't it? Just call a friend <laughs> to roast them. What so, are you going to say? So uh, I was just editing the video that I'm going to upload tomorrow, right? And um, yeah. you seem to be a little flustered on why there's black water in the catacombs. Yeah, dude, there was black water everywhere. Was it like that for you? <laughs> no, dude. <laughs> what the fuck? Why not? Because you were in low detail, dumbass. Oh, for... F yeah, I always forget to turn that <laughs> off. <laughs> I get like such a knob. You're <laughs> such a fucking. Idiot. And you've literally got this on record, so you're gonna put this in the video, aren't you? Yeah, I'm recording it right now. Well, yeah, thanks. Hello, YouTube. Hello, everyone. <laughs> um, what we're gonna be doing is we're gonna try and get ourselves a da dragon dagger. That is the most important thing we're going for today. Uh, dragon dagger is one in one to eight drop from the Dust Devils. If we get lucky, we can definitely get it. Then we're also gonna be going for the runes they drop and the mystic battle staffs is what we're looking for as well. We're gonna be going for a mage setup into a DDS would be the ideal thing. So that's what we're going for here. They also drop the kebabs, which heal 19 HP, which would be a huge food to get. And they drop four of them at a time. So that would be a really good food to get. That is the plan. Food, dragon dagger, and some magic stuff from Dusty's. Probably going to be here for about an hour. So the plan is to get Fire Wave. We've got Earth Runes as our first drop, which isn't going to be too useful. But uh, Fire Wave is what we're going for. And I'll probably head on over to Anku's later because they drop Blood Runes and Death Runes. So if we don't get Fire Wave, we'll still be able to do Fire Blast uh, with the remaining Death Runes we get. Seems like the best place to go for our spells. So the first thing we're going to do is get a whole bunch of cake because cake is the best food I can get right off the bat. Well, actually, we'll leave some inventory spots because it's really quick to get. Um, but we have literally no armor pretty much aside from this helmet. So we're going to get dogged with everything we kill. I'm going to have to prayer flick everything probably, but uh, there is an altar in the castle. So I can recharge it fairly easy. There we go, guys. We got our fire runes, which is very nice. That's what we needed. Also, I don't know if Rog mentioned this or not, but we can't loot other people's stuff. So if, say I see like fire runes on the floor, I can't take them because he left them. So after a little bit of hopping, I found an empty world for Necrols. Now, these guys drop a lot of armor pieces and a decent amount of weapons, so I'm hoping to get a little bit lucky here. These are going to be my backup plan in case I don't get enough runes because I actually want to go for the magic route. Ooh, a lobster! That is actually going to be really good in the final fight. So if we take a quick look at the drop table, they drop a rune axe, adamant battle axe, mystic air staff, adamant kite shield, rune square shield, rune med helm, rune full helm, rune boots, rune chain, a whole bunch of runes. So they drop a staff and they do drop a lot of runes, which is definitely what I really want. And a lot of those rune pieces will be really, really good in the final fight, especially if Link goes melee. I believe the best weapon might be a dragon dagger from um, Dust Devils. I'm not 100% sure. Probably a whip, actually, but if he goes for a whip and gets it, that would just be the craziest RNG in 
mean, honestly, I don't think he's going to risk that. So I'm going to say a Dragon Dagger is probably the best weapon realistically that a person can get for melee. Got some red dehyde vams and 24 bloody rune arrows. Honestly, we are uh, just getting range set up at the moment. But the thing is, like, the only way to get a bow, I think, is to go upstairs, cut a yew tree. So we'd have to get an axe drop, cut a yew tree, then fletch the bow, get bowstring from... I know something in here drops bowstrings. It just doesn't seem worth it. So realistically, it's probably going to go to waste, which is a bit of a shame. We need to get some mage stuff coming in. Just got a dust rune drop, and that means that we have now unlocked some spells. Um, obviously, we don't want to be using these. We're going for that fire wave, as I said. But, you know, we've got some magic unlocked. There it is, our first decent drop, a rune med helm. That is, that's exactly what I wanted to see. I got that really early on. But the horrible thing about necrols is that these little spawns hit you. And since I'm trying to prayer flick, it's not the best thing in the world because they sneak in hits like literally right in between my prayer flicks. So it's not the best thing in the world, but thankfully we can get cakes. I might, look at that, that little cheeky little two we just snuck in there. So yeah, I'm going to have to bank a lot. We're not bank, but get more food a lot more often than I thought. But uh, hey, if these drops keep it up, that's, you know, I'm totally okay with that. Just recharged my prayer and it was so much quicker than I expected. The necrols are really not that far from the entrance of the catacombs, so we can get there really quickly. So running out of prayer isn't the biggest deal in the world. Of course, see if I get a little better at prayer flicking, that will fix so many problems. But um, yeah, I'm trying to think of so many things and look at the wiki and look at drop tables. So I kind of kept it open a little bit there and I wasted a lot of prayer, but I think I have a pretty solid game plan of what I want to do now. We did get an Addy Axe, so we do now have an Addy Axe. We could go and cut that U down if we wanted to. I don't think I'm going to, but, you know, maybe it will be a last resort and I'll have to do it. Oh, yes! Oh, no way. I'm... Oh, my gosh. I'm, like, probably 10 kills in at the most. 10 kills in and I get Rune Boots. Honestly, even though I'm going magic, it's just like little drops like that that are just going to give me the edge because we're probably going to have incredibly similar gear. So every single armor piece is going to be huge. I really do believe that. What I'm going to go ahead and do is there is a cake stall upstairs. So I don't know if there's someone you can buy, like if there's a baker there and you could just buy cakes off him if not we'll just steal a few get a little bit of health back there's also the altar upstairs which is really nice um which means we could just go and recharge our prayer not like the last episode where we had to walk like half the map to sort it out um is there a baker oh yeah there is so we can just trade with him because i don't want to spend time like bloody thieving cakes you know so we're just gonna eat them nice Oh, we got the rune dagger. I mean, at least it's a weapon we can use. It does actually give a bonus in magic. Uh, those of you who don't know, any dagger in the game gives a one plus magic bonus. So if we don't manage to get a staff, which I'll be very surprised if we don't, we'll use that as our uh, mage weapon, and obviously we'll be able to stab with it as well, which is nice. Um, but we're, oh, I just hope we get the dragon dagger. Oh, there we go, boys, the air battle staff. Yes, that's what we wanted. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Um, I think I'm going to do an hour here. I really do. I want the DDS. I'd love to get it. I want some of the kebabs as well. If we could get those, that would be insane because they'd be sick healing food. A mystic air staff? Oh, my gosh. That's literally exactly exactly what I wanted. My main goal is to be able to cast fire wave so that means I just need a lot of blood runes and a lot of fire runes. Blood runes I can get very easily from blood veils and I think fire runes I can get a lot of them from dust devils and I'll also kill them and try to get a dragon dagger for a spec weapon for that fast KO. So things are, you know, let's see, we're 25 minutes in, almost 26 minutes in and uh, things are looking really really good right now. Oh, there we go, boys. The kebabs. That's exactly what we wanted. Four of those. That is some huge healing food. Oh, there we go. The Mystic Earth Staff. That is an upgrade. That is such an upgrade. Look at that. That's what we like to see. I'm thinking about it now. It's probably not that much of an upgrade. It's literally just better for what? Melee? I guess it's probably our best melee weapon. But... I won't be using Earth Runes for the spells I'm casting. Uh, I got a little bit overexcited about that one, I won't lie. If it wasn't for this altar right here, this would be a very, very difficult challenge. So I figured it was best to kill some Blood Veils now just to ensure that I have plenty of Blood Runes for the final fight. That's one thing I am worried about. These guys also drop some armor pieces as well, so I figured, you know what, let's get some Blood Runes early on and then we just don't have to worry about it later down the road. 30 Bloods! 
Honestly, I'm probably only gonna need like a hundred at most, and I think that is even over exaggerating. Ooh, fire runes on the ground. I don't want to leech off anyone else's, but they do drop fire runes. Honestly, I haven't killed blood in a while, so please forgive me. I'm not a hundred percent familiar with the drop table. I just got a mithril plate body, but this fat ass blood veld's in the way. Check that out. That's exactly what I want to see. I mean, I know I'm going magic, but that's still some pretty good defensive bonuses. Check this out. That's so many blocked melee hits right there. Heck yeah. If he tries to go in with a DDS or something, I'm blocking that shit. Jesus, I feel like I'm out on the town having a kebab after a night out. There is another four. We're up to eight. If we get four more, that would be awesome. Oh my god. Fucking hell. Yes, 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 yes. Let's go. <laughs> We're out of here. We are out of here. We're going to Ankus. Oh my god. Yes, we got it, boys. We got the fucking DDS. That is so ridiculously huge. We got the... um. The Mystic is actually the exact same drop rate. So we just got one in one, two, eight, twice in like, I don't know, maybe 60 kills or so. That's sick. I'm uh, going to recharge the prayer, going to get some food, and then we're going to go back to Anku's um, and grab ourselves some blood runes. Oh my god, we've won. We've won this. I'm calling it now. End the episode. So we just got another blood rune drop. So we're at 94 blood runes in total. I want to get either one or two more drops, depending on how quick I can get them. And then we're going to head on over to Dust Devils so we can get some more fire runes because I know they drop them pretty commonly. I think they drop them in 300 and in 50, and it's a pretty common loot there. So I'm not too worried about fire runes. And also, of course, you want to go for that dragon dagger. I want to get that spec weapon in, especially if he doesn't have one. That's a lot of DPS I could potentially do. Does anything drop Cosmics here? I gotta look into this, because that could be a strength amy right there. And I don't think I can get any other necklace. That could be huge. Fuck, in my haste, I forgot to buy more food. And I don't want to eat these, because they're massive. So I guess we're just going to go off these, try and prayer flick actually quite well. Um, oh my god, I am so... I cannot believe this has just happened. I'm going the wrong way. I've, lo I've lost my head. I've lost my head here. I've lost my head here. The, oh god, no, don't attack me, don't attack me. Um, no, I haven't lost my head, okay. Oh my god, well, I have lost my head. I'm so excited, I am so excited. Yeah, use the DDS spec, oh, that feels good. So what we're looking for is death runes and blood runes so that we can cast fire wave, that is the, uh, the plan now. There we go, there's our first few blood runes, very nice. Everything's shaping up perfectly, boys, I'm telling you. This is going so well. So after we're done recharging our prayer and getting another full inventory of cakes, we're going to head on over to the Twisted Banshees. Now, I didn't originally have these guys on my agenda, but they do drop Cosmic Runes, and I'll be able to enchant this Ruby Amulet into a Strength Ami. And they also drop some gear upgrades like an Adamant Kite Shield, Rune Full Helm, and best of all, they drop Cooked Swordfish. And if I can just get a couple of those, that'll be pretty awesome. Okay, so first trip over at the Ankus. We're coming out with 37 blood runes and 40 death runes, which is really nice. Um, gives us 37 casts straight away. Um, and also, we'll be able to cast quite a bit of, like, you know, like these fire blasts and stuff like that if it comes to it as a backup. I cannot wait because he's not going to expect me to have got the DDS and all of these. I just don't think he would have. The bloke's going to take his armor off. Kins is going to have to take his armor off because I'm maging him. And then we're just going to go in for the DDS spec. Bang, bang. See you later. It's going to be beautiful. These guys are so easy to hit. I don't even think I'm going to bother protecting from melee. I'm just going to flick Pity at this point. I mean, yeah, they're going to do some damage. Oh, okay. They can both attack me. Let's just get in the corner. And then, you know, we'll do the same plan because this, uh, this should work pretty well. And why am I not attacking anymore? Ah, damn it. Upgrades, Adam and Kite Shield, check me out. Just gotta be careful not to walk by the dragons now, but I can use this in the final fight, so it's a lot of defense bonuses right there. I mean, hopefully he's not going mage, but I have a strong feeling he is, only because I think that's, you know, definitely the best way to go about this whole situation. Crap, I'm getting dogged again. Oh my god, we just got weapon poison. I think that's a rare drop from here, which we can now use on the DDS. Oh my, this is perfect. This is perfect, boys. Another rune med? What? I mean, I already have one, but hey, that's uh, just cool to see on the ground, you know? You know my boy Dirty Frank over here is thinking, what the hell are you wearing, boy? What the hell are you doing at Twisted Banshees in this gear? You look like an absolute pleb. Oh, <gasps> cosmic runes! Okay, all right, let's get in the safe spot real quick. And these guys actually dog you. I definitely need prayer. I was totally wrong on that assessment before, but okay, 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 let's take this off. This is huge gains. That is so great, an amulet of strength. 
Oh, I'm so excited. Look at that. Some of this stuff we definitely just have to get rid of. We just have to get rid of Ah, uh, keep the shield, the extra rune med, the adamant long sword I thought about. It. I'm definitely just not going to use that whatsoever. Even if I want to use melee, I'll just bash with the mystic air staff. I believe that gives much better stats. If not, still it's an extra inventory space for food that I'll have to give up. Um, so the next thing is to definitely kill dust devils, try to get enough fire runes and also that dragon dagger. We have about 45 minutes left on the clock. So, I mean, I'm feeling very optimistic. I think a dragon dagger is one out of 128. Even if we don't get it, that's totally okay. They drop the Ugg Thanky kebabs, I think they're called. So we can definitely get a decent amount of those and hopefully get a lot of fire runes as well. And uh, if hey, if I end it just like that, I will be very, very happy. What is my RNG at the moment? We got a dark totem middle from one of these Ankus as well. I am going to go ahead and bank this. I know we said no banking, but I'm sure Rog will be fine with my pursuit to get the Skatizo pet. I really want it. <laughs> I want my first pet, and Skatizo seems the way to go in terms of how much Slayer I do down in the catacombs. Um, so I am going to bank this, and uh, all you guys in the chat who are like, Link cheated. No, no, I didn't. I just need this. Here we go. You can watch the bank interaction. There we go, and we're out. Pray up, we're gonna go get ourselves a few more bits of food. I keep missing this cake. I'm gonna eat this cake up. A few more bits of food and then we're gonna go back. I might actually have to thieve the cakes because that bread really wasn't worth taking with us. And um, yeah, I think I might have to go and thieve. Oh yeah, this is like the super easy one you can thieve from. It's probably worth it to be honest. Like you can't get caught, it's super easy. Right, we're coming up to the last half an hour, and what I'm going to do in the last half an hour is just get food together. Um, the plan is, I don't know whether to go to, back to Dust Devils and try and get the kebabs, or go to Banshees. Twisted Banshees drop um, swordfish cooked very commonly. I think it's common. Um, it's such a hard decision. The thing with the, uh, with the Dusties is they drop four of these at a time, and they heal five more each one than a swordfish does but i just don't know if i'm going to get another drop i might waste the next half an hour without getting them they're um uncommon i think um as a drop so i think i'm going to go to twisted banshees maybe i'll do like a few minutes of twisted banshees if i get a few swordfish then uh i'll stick there if i don't get any maybe i'll go up to dusty's i just don't know guys there it is fire runes uh 370 now now i think each cast i need seven of them and i only have the um air staff so i'm gonna actually need to use the fire rune so probably one more drop and i will be very uh satisfied with that because that's around 100 blood runes because i have over 700 so i'm getting a little nervous there are 17 and a half minutes left in the competition and i haven't gotten any kebab drops yet now they drop them in groups of four so even one drop will be extremely beneficial to the account build that I'm making right now. And uh, the thing is, if I go with cakes, I'm probably not going to win. I can't out eat anything with cakes. He could be poking me with a freaking adamant longsword, right? And I probably won't be able to out eat with cakes. I spend my whole time eating. I learned my lesson with teas and I am not doing that again. I've killed so many banshees and nothing has come out from it. Um, I'm also a little bit stuck here. I need to run past all of these and the Dagonauts. Fuck. We might be a little bit screwed for food here, guys. Hopefully, Rog's having some issues as well. Did I really get a dark totem base before I get kebabs? Now I know Jagex is just trolling me right now. Oh, ah. Not a single swordfish, guys. I've got, like, two Raynars. I've got loads of seeds that are fucking rare. It just hasn't come out. It just has not come out for us. Hopefully, Rog doesn't have good food. If he does... Then he has a very good chance of winning this, even with the gear we've managed to get. Which should be so upsetting, because the RNG has been so good for gear, but just in terms of food... Oh dear, we're going to have to go get cakes, aren't we, as the rest of the food, I think. And then we'll go from there. Oh my god, yes! Holy shit! Oh my god, okay. Pick it up, 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 just bury the bones. Ah! Oh my god, I just got more! This is what I'm talking about. It's hidden under the freaking fire runes. Not fire runes, earth runes. I'm freaking out right now that I can't even talk right. I'm so excited. I was getting so nervous. Oh, this, ma this makes me feel so much better. There we go, boys and girls. Four minutes left on the clock, but I am just going to call it there. Um, as you can see, we've really gone very minimalistic here. The air battle stuff and literally nothing else. But we do have that secret weapon of the dragon dagger. Um, the really good healing kebabs as well, which... 
it's so annoying we didn't get a few more of those, but we're just going to have to deal with that. And then obviously we're going to be using the Fire Wave. We've got 47 casts of that. And then once we run out of Blood Runes, we'll go on over to the uh, Fire Blast, which we have 100 casts of. So quite a lot of casts of both of those. We shouldn't run out. Um, I have got some Chaos Runes just in case. Um, I thought the Chaos Runes would be worth the Cake Switch. Um, so yeah, that's what we're going in with. Hopefully Rug doesn't have great food. If he doesn't, this should be ours. Black Dehyde Vans, probably not the best option because I'm maging, so I'm probably just going to leave that there. Yeah, kind of unfortunate, but it is what it is. This is the last Dust Devil kill. Wish me luck. Still need to go get some more cake, so I don't want to cut it too close. Eh, nothing. Literally nothing. Wow, that's depressing. But look at this, guys. This is pretty much our final gear. Probably way negative on magic. Negative 34, probably not going to wear the plate body. All right, it's time to drop everything I'm not going to use. I'll probably keep the death runes, drop the chaos. Do I need soul runes for anything? Could I Could I do anything? Honestly, I'm just going to drop those. Drop those, drop those, drop those. Drop that. I don't want to drop that. <laughs> drop that. Um, yeah, okay. I have 20 seconds to fill up with cakes. That'll be incredibly easy to do. And uh, yeah, and then I guess I'll see you guys at Edgeville. Oh boy, that <laughs> went a lot quicker than I anticipated. Yeah, it did, didn't it? It flew by. Oh, man. Oh, God. But I feel like the stakes are so much higher because we've invested more time in. I know. You know? It really is. And there's so... Like the, like, the total amount of gear that you could have gotten is so vast that it could be anything that you have right yeah. there. And uh, I gotta be honest, I don't think I have the best gear. So... Well, we'll see, won't we, mate? All right. We'll see. Should we slowly start revealing what we have? Yeah. Go on, start asking. All right, weapon. Gonna pop that weapon on. Yeah. Okay, yeah. It's actually Wait one of the go. best melee weapons too with 50 melee strength. Yeah. For a yeah. mystic, you, you have a mystic? Uh, yeah, yeah, I got him. Oh no, I've got a battle staff. Oh, look at that, I already have Is yours head. a mystic? Mine's a mystic. Uh, head? Okay. I got nothing. <laughs> oh, <I'm sorry. laughs> you were like waiting for me you can't do that man you can't do that oh dear okay uh necklace nothing strength ammy did you cosmic tally it i had a look at i it. did i had a look at doing that but... yeah <laughs> okay all right uh body i got nothing dude what were you doing the last two hours of your life <laughs> oh dear fucking hell dude okay. what is wrong with you man honestly a lot mate a lot all right all right shields i did get something but i banked it <laughs> i got any kite as well okay but i don't have it with me I've, I've sacrificed food for it dude you're freaking me out right now <laughs> i mean i know exactly what you're going for you're maging so i mean i i know i know your game plan but yeah, uh all right legs do you have anything? <laughs> Let me just ask that. <laughs> I don't have anything. I also got rune boots somehow. Fucking hell. But, Did you get any legs? Uh, no legs. So my crusty okay. knees are still wide out in the open, my friend. And it's great okay. because, look, if you if you angle the shield at a perfect <laughs> angle, it looks like I'm not wearing any pants. Oh, my God. You're disgusting. <laughs> you look like a disgusting old man. Look at you. <laughs> look at you. I look more respectable than you, and I'm wearing nothing. <laughs> right, Kins, food. Okay, I also have eight cakes with whatever is in my inventory right now. Eight okay. cakes. I got eight um, a thank you kebabs, two lobsters, and some tuna. I got eight. Okay. I got all those cakes. All right. Blood runes, death runes, fire runes, chaos runes. Oh, we're showing our whole inventory? Okay, all right, I'll spill the beans. I'll spill the beans, you got me. Anything else? Well, I got some... Those are pretty useless, if you ask me, but, uh, yeah. Ah, oh, fucking <laughs> hell! <laughs> Hanky's dropped me weapon poison as well. Fuck! <laughs> It's a good thing I kept the armor, dude. I was contemplating on dropping it, but I was like, if he gets a DDS, I need something to tank myself with. 
<laughs> Fuck. This is going to be so interesting. So as I'm waiting for Link to run up to 13 Wilderness to meet me so we can have this death match, make sure to check out Link's video at the end of this video. He posted a video the exact same time I did, and we were in dead man mode for two hours with times 10 XP rates. Absolutely amazing episode, guys, I assure you. So go check it out as soon as this one's over. The link is down in the description. All right, I'm taking that I'm taking that body off because this fucking slime yeah. ball is, uh... Stop getting close to me, bro. <laughs> ba back up, man. All right, you ready? No. I'm living stats. All right, I'm, go. I'm attack, like, attack, right, attack, right, attack, yeah. attack, attack. <laughs> Boom. Big oh, hit, yes. Oh, That's what we want to see. What? Oh, my God. Come That's on. huge. That's huge. Come on, bro, boots. I really you gotta keep my distance shit. here. Am I fucking splattering? <laughs> Man's running. Man is running. I mean, yeah, I'm running. <laughs> oh, fuck, that's a big hit. That's a big hit. Neither of us are hitting. What's not, going on? Not a very accurate spell, is it? <laughs> Armor. Oh, oh, tanked. Oh, my God. Fuck, 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 fuck. What's the matter, Link? You look like you're struggling over there. Oh. <clears throat> Oh, oh, I was about to take my armor off too. Oh fuck, I'm fuming. <laughs> oh no, 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 no. Come on. Yo, you're not hitting what the hell? I'm in, yeah, I'm like, I was in full armor. There we go. Beautiful. Oh crap. Yeah, I, I spoke too soon. I'm gonna start yumming it up over here though. Man's yeeted it! Probably gonna keep my shield on just for safe measures right now. Oh, that didn't work. That didn't work. E oh! oh my god! Put on armor. Oh, oh shit! Oh my god! <laughs> oh no! I've been fucking PJ'd by the bear. Oh, poison. Bear, shit. fuck off! Oh fuck off, wow! And it's funny because in the <laughs> no. last episode you asked the bear to PJ you, and he's returning the yeah. favor. <laughs> See, I'm probably gonna bash you. No, no, take take this off. Take this off. Oh, bad. Oh, Fuck off. no. <laughs> Great location. <laughs> <laughs> right, out of here. Fuck. Yeah, big, big hits. Come on. All right. I'm gonna dance you in the trees a little bit. Mm. Boom. Come on. Come on. Actually, trees are probably not my best idea yet. And you get really close God, to me. Oh, big hit, spider. big hit, big hit. Come on. Bang! Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. I'm fuming. That's good. That's oh, good. Fuck. That's good. And the poison. Come on. Come on, Rog. Tank it, tank it, tank it, tank it. Oh my oh, god. Shit. What the fuck? Oh shit. Oh my god, kids. I can't believe I've hit zero. 20 zero. Come on. That's big. That's big. That's big. Fuck. Alright. Bang. Dead. 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 Come on. <laughs> oh, that poison. Just keep hitting him. Just keep hitting him, poison. I love how we're having an eating break. Right? <laughs> I know. <laughs> I was expecting you to run after me, but I guess not. Oh, fuck. Crap. God, come on. Attack him. Why aren't you attacking him? Bang. Oh, come on. Bang. Come on. Come on. Come on. Big hits. No, I need some big hits. Big hit. I need some big hits. Big hits. Stop splattering. Yes, get him. Ooh. Oh, oh no. my God. How do I keep hitting fucking zeros? Shit, shit, shit. Come on, come on. Hit, 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 hit. Keep hitting, keep hitting, keep hitting, keep hitting. There we no. go. No, no. Yeah. <laughs> come on. <laughs> Fuck. Yes. Oh my god, I didn't think I was going to have that. Shit! <laughs> yes! How much food did you have? Oh, not that much. Oh. 
<laughs> oh dear. <sighs> oh kids. Oh, that that feels good. I'm not gonna lie. How much food did you have left? I had one, two, three, four, five, six cakes and a kebab left. That is going to conclude this episode, guys. So go make sure to check out Link's video. It went live the exact same time this one did. So that means if you're watching this video right now, it is live. The link is down in the description. Link, before I end the video, do you have anything you want to tell the viewers? Um, sub to Link. <laughs> right. Fuck, now my phone's turned off. <laughs> Shameless plug, okay? <laughs> <laughs>